So guys, with my buddy Alex, this is like the first official day that I've been back uh, since they, I don't want this wind to mess you guys up, but since, since they made us leave Savannah because of the hurricane and everything. So today I actually need to film a product video right now, so I'm about to go ahead and do that. I'm about to rig some stuff up. If you guys want to go check that video out, I'm sure it's going to be up very soon. It's going to be over the hoax uh, crawl. You guys can go check that one out. I want to show like how I rig it, how I retrieve it, um, where I would fish it, stuff like that. Tip videos that you guys would really enjoy, but we're going to go out here, we're going to fish this in a bit, but I'm going to go ahead and film that tutorial video, that hoax fishing uh, crawl video right now. Huh? Oh. 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 Bro, that's a big one. <laughs> Bro, no, I'm not even kidding. Unless I hooked him in the side. Look. Yeah. Did I? Yep. Oh, it's actually a good one, though. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Boy. <laughs> Dude, I honestly thought I had like a five or six pounder. All right, so I hooked this fish. This is literally the first fish of the day. Hooked him on that rattle trap, so red eye shad. I hooked him, guys, and he took off like boop, right in the middle out there. He's not a bad fish at all though. Look at him, he's kind of chunky. But I hooked him like right here, so I thought he was a giant, but not a bad fish. Let's catch some more. So guys, this rail trap right here, the red eye shad, just the red one. It was running a little weird, and I didn't like how it was running. So after the first fish, dude, I thought it was a giant. I'm just deciding to put on a different one. Let's see what I got. So many. Oh, so many to choose from. I think in this XP caliber one right there. I think that's gonna do the job. Guys, like normally this water, you know I'd come out here and I'd fish worms and stuff, but this water is extremely dirty. And blooper. This water is extremely dirty and is really bad, like really dirty, so what I'm doing is I'm tying on this rattle trap. It's going to have a lot of vibration. And also the water is very, very dirty, like I just said. So not only is it going to have the vibration, it's going to have that red color. It's going to be pretty bright. It's going to be good. You know, they're going to feel that vibration. They're going to come attack it. There's a lot of grass over here. I'm fishing on the edge of that grass line. That's where I got that first fish. I know there's plenty of fish out there, so we're about to whale on them. He was tugging hard, wasn't he? Dang. Oh my god. What? You bring pliers? <laughs> he ate it, bro. <laughs> Let's see. Let's see. Good, dude. There you go. Number two, guys. Alex got him a decent little rattle trap back. All right, guys, just pack the ball of stuff right now. What was that? <laughs> what was that? I don't know. Well, that was <laughs> oh, weird. Well. <laughs> so pack the ball of stuff right now. We only caught two here, so we're going to a different pond real quick. I got a lot of stuff I got to do today, so I'm just trying to get this over with. Try to catch some fish so you guys can see me catch some fish and then, you know, make a video. So catch you guys at the next pond. Oh, look at that. You see him running with it? Small, dude. dude, what is going on in this place? Oh, look at him running with yeah, it. Why are they that small? I don't know. Oh, I thought a big one ate him. So funny, I thought he was smaller than that. Dude, I'm not even kidding. All right, guys, first fish at the second pond. I don't know what's going on. This is a little guy. I thought he was smaller than that, to be honest. I, like, I had a feeling like there was a big one eating them. All right, guys, so we're at the second pond. All the OG kicking their ass TV fans know what this place is. But, dude, this place is so down. That's where it's usually supposed to be. It's all the way right here. Like, that's bad. And, honestly, I think most of the fish are dead. Like, I hate to say this because this is, like, literally the pond I grew up on. And, like, it's literally down nothing he had a bite first cast a little tiny one i had a few bites and you could tell they're super small and then i just caught a small one but you know this sucks you know this is like a sad moment for me like all the structure that was in there it's out of the water it's just 
I don't know, they probably died because I've caught many of five and like I, I caught a nine pounder, nine to 10 pounder in here when I first started fishing. Like just the thing that's just blow and probably all the big fish are dead just sucks. But we're gonna see, we're gonna keep on fishing, see if we can catch some more. All right, about knocked my camera out there. I'm tired of these little turds. I'm tired of them. Dude, he's playing me. Look at him running. Number two, boy. This is a leaf running with. I think that's how they eat it. Oh! <laughs> Dude, you thought I was joking with you, didn't you? <laughs> you gotta, you gotta do it right. Oh boy, look how small this guy is. He thought I was messing with him when I was just hitting the back of my rock. All right guys, so I was teaching Alex. You gotta throw it out. All right, you let it sink to the bottom. Once it's on the bottom, you reel up your slack, and then you go. All right. If you don't hit it, you, you let it sit for a minute. Then you reel it back up. I'm telling you, dude. If you still don't hit it, you just gotta keep waiting. Maybe even slightly do it. Just. <laughs> you done? Dude, I'm done. Like literally, I'm completely done. I don't even know what to say anymore. <laughs> no, I'm not even kidding though. Like literally if you watch a fish, like say you're sight fishing and you see a fish down there and your bait's next to him, just start tapping it and it barely moves it and it like makes him eat it. I'm not even kidding. But there you go guys, that's how you do it right there. Remember just knock the back of your rod. Catch you some hogs. I gotta remember the pattern I use. I think it was. Oh, I was like, they didn't like rap music. <laughs> Wait. Oh my, dude, dude. No, 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 this is a huge fish, oh Alex. Watch your, watch your line. Oh, oh Jesus, dude. <laughs> what the? <laughs> dude. <laughs> dude. Dude. <laughs> Are you bro. kidding me? Are you kidding me? Are you that kidding me? That is nice. Me? Dude, I told you he didn't like <laughs> rap music. He only liked the rock music, so you couldn't like hit it like the trap. You got do, 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 do. Dude. That is a nice. This is a technique for bastards. I cannot believe I got him up this hill though. I would have cried if he dropped off. Guys, look at this fish. That is a beautiful fish. God, dude, I can't believe that. I told you there's some good ones in here. I thought they all died though. You see, you see him eat it right there? Dang. All right, guys, that's probably gonna conclude our night to be honest. Look at that hog. I gotta take a picture of this. All right, guys, beautiful fish. You're getting this picture, Alex, for the bit for the video. All right. Like, just hop in. All right, guys, beautiful fish. Let's get a release. That is a nice bass. Dude, holy crap. That was a good one. That was the best one we caught down here yet. Yeah, I see your line moving, dude. Yeah, he has it, though. Yeah, he's got it. Get him. Get him. Is it a good one? 
My bad. Way, My bad. <laughs> but guess what? You use the secret. How many is it? That's five here, dude. I think we can catch another hog. He pissed himself. <laughs> there you go, Alex. That's number five here. There you go. <laughs> so, guys. What are you doing, dude? <laughs> <laughs> so, guys. Just got off the lake. Um, it's getting dark right now, but that place, you know, it kind of hurt me to see that place flooded, but I hope you guys learned, you know, like the number one secret to bass <laughs> fishing. Like, you gotta tap it. Yeah, yeah, tap it. You gotta tap it. The, honestly, that's pretty funny. I was just messing around, but honestly, being completely honest with you guys, like if I'm sight fishing and stuff, and I'm like fishing in front, like I'm a bed fish and stuff like that, I will hit the end of the rod just to give it a little bit of movement. But I like I would never just do it just fishing out there. But I was just messing around and I did it, and I was like, oh my god, they're eating it like that. So <laughs> that I'm not gonna complain. Caught a good fish, but uh, I'm about to head back. I'm gonna drop him off, go and eat with my parents out for dinner. All right, guys, I'm gonna end off the vlog. Got Kyle over here and. Alex but guys hope you enjoyed today's video I hope you got the number one secret tip to bass fishing just remember that guys but thank you guys so much for watching stay tuned for tomorrow's video check out yesterday's video a video comes out every day except for Saturdays at 6 p.m. Easter time go check it out catch you guys tomorrow